Well, hello there, Cougars. It is Monday. It is May 6th, and we've got a lot of stuff going on, some great stuff, actually. Uh, shout out to our uh, large group performers from Saturday. Uh, uh, orchestra, the Symphony Orchestra, earned a Division I. Um, the uh, Concert Choir and Chamber Choir both got Division I. Wind Symphony got a Division I. Symphonic Band got a, a Division I. So congratulations to all of those groups and to everyone who participated, all the other uh, uh, groups that we had got Division II ratings. Uh, so nice job to everybody. Hard work went into that, I know, and uh, proud of you. Keep up the good work. Keep on focusing on uh, improving your craft. And just a reminder, speaking of orchestra, the Symphonic Rock Concert is Friday, May 17th. The tickets are $7 for adults, $5 for students. Can be ordered online at Kenneth, crkennedyorchestra.weebly.com uh, ahead of time. And uh, you'll also get to hear at this particular uh, orchestra rock concert which is just fun first of all you're going to have mr hall back with the symphonic rock all-stars okay so mr hall's going to be here i assume playing bass because he's that's what he does he's awesome at it and two moonlight is going to be singing bohemian rhapsody so that in and of itself is worth five dollar admission it really is so you got that going on may 17th it's a friday night it's the best concert of the year come on out and enjoy that rock concert and then i also want to give a big shout out a huge shout out to our cougar electric car company Wow, did they have a weekend. They went to Nebraska. They went to the Nebraska State Championships, and they just said, why don't we just win this thing, and then we'll take second place as well. That's what they did to Nebraska. Nice job there. The 985 car with Rodrigo, Brian, and Kaylee finished first in handling, braking, design, documentation, and endurance. They won all five categories. They won the state championship. And then the 983 car with John, Colin, Derek, and Kaylee, and Brian finished second in handling, second in braking, Second in design, second in documentation, and third in endurance, so they got second place in the state. So Cougar Electric Car goes over to Nebraska and just ruins the state championship for Nebraska. Well done there. Uh, great job, guys. I know you worked really hard on, the, on, on this, and uh, that is really just awesome, really, really awesome. I think the only thing left then is the Iowa State Championship, I think. I think that's what's left. So good luck to you guys in that. Uh, awesome job. Really, really proud of you. One other thing I want to talk about really quick, because I'm sure you probably heard about it, um, I have made the decision that we're not going to have Smart Time next year. You may have heard that uh, based upon a variety of different factors. The most important is that uh, we're not seeing any real change in grades, uh, test scores, anything academic uh, as a result of five years of having Smart Time or Smart Lunch. And so uh, not seeing any results and not getting anything um, out of it that way is a really big factor. That and uh, we, it's it's eating away class time. So we're going to have a little bit longer classes, not significantly longer, but a little bit longer classes and five minutes of passing time next year to accommodate people getting to class on time, which will be a very important thing. Uh, but I did want to get ahead of that and make sure that you know. Uh, so just uh, if you have any questions, you can come find me. I'm always around. Uh, see me at lunch and I'll be glad to answer them for you. But I just want to let you know that. All right. Got a lot of announcements. Go get them, Lainey. We sure do. All right. This year's senior walks are fast approaching. Seniors, this is a chance to return to your elementary school before graduation. You'll walk through the building in your cap and gown. Some of the schools have also set aside time for question and answer. Each walk should take 15 to 30 minutes. Any senior can sign up. Preference will be given to students who have attended that elementary school. Sign-up sheets are located in the main office. Can I pause there for one second? Please, if you're going to sign up, and I want you to sign up, please make sure you can actually go on that day and time. Because last year we had a lot of students who signed up and then a lot no-showed. And that's really bad because they line the entire elementary school hallways up with all the kids, everybody. And then it's really not great if like only three or four seniors show up. So please make sure you sign up and make sure that you can go the day you sign up for. And it's really a lot of fun. You will have a great time with this. The kids get very excited. They love seeing you guys in your caps and gowns. So please sign up. All right. All right. Sorry. <laughs> seniors, don't forget to submit your pictures to the Senior Slideshow to be at graduation. Email Ken with two ends vision at gmail.com. Two pictures, one baby or child picture, and one picture that is recent. Be sure to include your name. These are due no later than Friday, May 10th. That is coming up. Also, seniors, Zio Janos is offering Kennedy High School Class of 2019 a certificate to receive an 8-inch gondola sub for free. Stop by the attendance window to receive your certificate. Congratulations on all your hard work. Attention all students taking one or more AP exams this year. If you're taking a morning exam on May 5th through May 16th, you're expected to be back at school by the beginning of 6th hour. If you're taking a morning exam on Friday, May 17th, you're excused for the entire day. If you're taking an afternoon exam on Monday through Thursday, you're excused after smart time. And if you're taking an afternoon exam on Friday, May 10th, you're excused after second hour. If you're taking an afternoon exam on Friday, May 17th, you're excused after third hour. Please make sure to eat a good breakfast and lunch in the exam days. See Ms. Ritchie if you have any questions. 
Junior's Gear Up Family Night is tomorrow, May 7th, in the auditorium from 5.30 to 7. Please plan ahead with your parents. Also, if you haven't signed up for the Senior Year Prep Seminar, please see Mrs. Mead in room 252. Active Minds is Kennedy's Mental Health Awareness Club, and it is May... In May is Mental Health Awareness Month. To support and end the stigma of mental illness, we invite you to wear green on Thursday, May 16th. We also invite you to use the hashtag KHS Mental Health Awareness to show your support with photos of your green outfit to tag Mental Health Awareness Facts all month. On May 16th, during Smart Time, our school therapy dog Phineas will be in the horseshoe weather permitting. Please sign up outside Mrs. Mullen's room 107 and spend the time with her on that day. Space is limited. Students, information about summer school will be available in the counseling office. Summer school will be held at Kennedy June 10th to July 3rd. If you need to retake a core class, stop by, please stop by the counseling office for more information. Space is limited and registration will be prioritized by grade level on the first come, first serve basis. The deadline to register for summer school is June 6th. Attention, current sophomores and juniors, if you're interested in taking American government or economics online this summer, please stop in the counseling office to sign up so we can gauge the interest. There will be a $75 fee associated with each course due at the start of the class, tentatively June 1st. Spaces are limited. 2019, the decision, the, the 2019 decision day is right around the corner. We'll just cut that part out. It'll be fine. Counseling office invites graduating seniors to join us Friday, May 10th, in the upper IMC between 9 and 1. To celebrate you and your future, the event will honor graduating seniors who plan to continue education at colleges or universities, apprenticeships or training programs, a list listing in the military, or entrance in the workforce. All decisions are being celebrated on Decision Day. Decision Day also involves cookies and lemonade. So if celebrating your decision is not enough, let it be a cookie that brings you in. Completing final transcripts requests will also happen that day. Also, there will be the senior banner to sign and so much more where your college, university, training school, military gear for that day, bring your best smile, photo opportunities will be available, and all graduating seniors are welcome. IMC, May 10th. If you're interested in signing, the Kennedy, signing up for the Kennedy French trip during spring break 2020, stop by room 73A to get a registration packet from Madame Lang. Registrations and down payments are due by June 5th. See you in Paris. Cougar Corner Food Pantry is pleased to announce the addition of Goodwill vouchers as part of its inventory for all students. Each voucher is worth $10 of shoes or clothing at Goodwill stores. Students will need a valid ID to redeem the voucher. Please come to the Cougar Corner during regular business hours. That's Tuesdays and Fridays, 7 to, 7 to 7.50 and 2.30 to 4, and you can pick one up. And don't forget, this is Teacher Appreciation Week. All week long, you should show appreciation to your teachers because they do amazingly hard things to make you learn. And sometimes it causes them a lot of stress, just so you know. So, if you want to do something nice for your teacher, you could get them a small gift, or you could make them a small note, or you could just tell them that you really appreciate them, because all those things would make them feel really great. So, consider it today, tomorrow, all week, Teacher Appreciation Week. Say thank you to your teachers. Birthdays today. Happy birthday to Amani Dorsey, Daniel Eads, and Isabel Wright, and Mr. Dan Law, our building trades teacher, who will never see these announcements probably, but... That house, do you know they sold that house in like two days this year? They sold that house in two days. It's a gorgeous house. Everyone did such a nice job out there. Such a nice job. So, happy birthday, Mr. Law. Good job. Uh, activities for today. Of course, today is the first day of AP exams. We've got Chinese, U.S. government and politics and environmental science. And summer uh, sports practice begins today for softball. And I know softball's been counting it down on Twitter for like the last three months. So, I think they're kind of excited. And, of course, we've got Girls Varsity Divisional Golf at the Meadows Golf Course. Uh, good luck to our golfers this morning. Hopefully it's not too soggy out there for you. And we've got tennis at the University of Northern Iowa today uh, at 4 o'clock. JV Tennis uh, is at here at home. We've got JV2 Soccer at Iowa City Liberty. We've got Boys JV Tennis at Xavier. We've got JV Girls Track and Field at, at West. And we've got boys JV, field, JV uh, track and field at West. So good job, good luck to them. And then we've got a JV2 boys match of soccer at Liberty. So we've got a lot of stuff going on today. And to get it in before the big rains come on Wednesday, let me tell you, it's going to rain on Wednesday. What's for lunch today? All right, for lunch today, Station 1 and 2 is Burger Basket with Fries. Station 3 is Salad Subs, Parfaits, Hot Dogs, and Cheeseburgers. Station 4 is Pasta Bar with Breadstick. And Station 5 is Sweet Thai Chicken with Roasted Vegetables and an Alternative Cheese Pizza. Pretty good menu. I hope you have a great day today. Treat each other with kindness and respect. Say thank you to a teacher. And as always, go Coops.